Hi guys, in this video I will show you how to make insane logo flip easy. Duplicate the video twice and rename. First will be, flip. Second, clean and last one, original. Toggle off flip and original layers. Go a few frames forward from where you want logo flip to start and cut the clean layer at that moment. Also cut the end of the effect. This will be my start and ending of logo flip effect. Now grab pen tool and mask the logo quickly, you don't have to mask logo perfectly, simply mask it we will need to remove the logo from a car. Press M button on your keyboard, right click on a mask and click on track mask. Go to tracker and track the mask forward. As tracking is done, change mask mode to subtract. Now go to window tab and enable, content aware fill. Go to content aware fill, copy my settings and click on, generate fill layer. This will remove car logo from the car. Cool, now move fill layer under the flip layer, cut the fill layer as well. Toggle on, flip layer and original layers. Cut the flip layer as well. Now we have to mask logo on a flip layer, but this time masking should be perfect. For masking you can use pen tool, ellipse tool, roto brush tool or you can use mocha AE for the best results in masking and tracking. Once you are in Mocha, click on Ellipse tool and make a nice selection of the logo. Then toggle on Perspective and click on Tracking button. As tracking finished, click on Save button and close Mocha AE. Open Matte and click on Create AE Masks. Now click on Anchor Point tool and make sure to move the anchor point to the center of the logo. Enable 3D on Flip layer and open Transform. At the beginning of the flip layer, create keyframes for, position, scale and Y rotation. Now go to very end of the flip layer and create their same keyframes. Now go somewhere in the middle and change, scale, position and Y rotation. Copy middle keyframes and paste them near to the end. Enable motion blur on flip layer to smooth the motion. Now select all created keyframes and press F9 to easy ease keyframes. Then click on graph editor and make nice curve. You can do like mine or play around until it will make you happy. Now let's add explosion effect on the logo. So as the logo hits back, there will be explosion. You can download this explosion for free, just check the description of this video. Go to time where the logo is near to hit and move explosion layer to that moment. Now duplicate the original layer and move it to the top of explosion layer. Rename that layer to logo only. Cut logo only layer at the moment where flip and clean layer ends. Move explosion layer down the flip layer. Now let's mask the logo, I will use Mocha AE for the best results. Under the Mocha, open Matte and click on Create AE Masks. Cool. Now let's track the explosion under the badge. Select the original layer and go to Tracker. Click on Track Motion. Find a good contrasted point and track that point till the end of the video. You can track automatically but I prefer doing it manually frame by frame for best results. Now create new null object. Then click, Edit Target, and make sure to select Null Object. Click on Apply and make sure Apply Dimensions are set to X and Y. Now click on Explosion Layer and link it with Null Layer. Enable 3D on Explosion Layer. Now Explosion is tracked under the badge. You can scale or position as you will enjoy it more. Cool. Let's add shake effect to it. Select all layers and pre-compose them into the one layer. Go to the moment where logo is almost to hit back and add twitch effect there. If you don't have twitch plugin, check out this video's description, I will leave a download link there. Change amount to 15 and speed to 10, expand enable and toggle on, blur, light and slide. Click on stopwatch icon on amount to create a keyframe. Now go a few frames forward and change amount to zero. Press U on your keyboard to see all keyframes. Go backward something around this and set amount to zero. 
cool I'm happy with it. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and like the video please.